tonight. Three sailors stranded at sea, now safe, after this incredible rescue, necessary when their 30-foot boat was attacked over and over again by small sharks for days, hundreds of miles off the coast of Australia. Here you can see half the boat submerged in water as rescue choppers circled above to save the three crew members. The two Russians and one Frenchman issued a distress call early on Wednesday when it was clear they couldn't make it back to land on their own. The emergency beacon absolutely saved their life. It enabled the Rescue Coordination Centre to identify their precise location and tailor the most appropriate and quickest response to rescue them. The sailors were supposed to go from the Pacific Island nation of Vanuatu to the Australian city of Cairns as part of a years-long around-the-world journey. But they never made it because these cookie-cutter sharks, a small species, check them out, only 16 inches long but certainly menacing, attacked the catamaran repeatedly. First, the boat started to take on water but was able to trudge along for another 100 miles before the sharks attacked again, this time piercing its right side, and the boat then began to sink completely. There's many reasons that vessels are attacked by sharks. However, the, the motivations of these sharks is, is unclear. The sailors, according to Australian officials, all happy to be rescued unharmed, and their belongings all safe tonight as well. But the catamaran lost at sea, leaving the future of their grand round-the-world voyage up in the air. Noah Pransky, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.